Okay, guys, we just left the Sandy. This is Block V. So follow me, and we've got to go find Charles Dickens's son, who's buried in here. Going past Hillary's grave, Alexander Way. Now we've got to go over that side. So we're leaving AZ and we're going down this road all the way down. So yeah, as you can see guys, in that far distance, that's where the entrance was when we came in. And that over there, those trees, that's the road that we came up. So we've come back down the central, like, through the central road and we're back at like the main roundabout. So yeah, this is the easiest way to get to this section that we need, which is section L, by the way. Well, that's always sad to see. Yeah, thought it was, yeah. Greenwood Road, guys. And that. So, if you want those two graves that I've just shown you on the last videos and that, you might as well just walk maybe straight up here and then just turn a fraction left. Yes, it's block 12. That's block 11. Just to let you know, guys, if you haven't seen my video of um, Howard Carter, he go at the top of this section and he's like halfway down right on the big, the, um, you know, where this section ends. Yes, yeah, so this is section seven, that's section eight. We've got to go this way, guys.
So that's box six, guys. Oh, I think this is the section we need, but I need the marker. It's definitely older greys, which will tally. And also the scenery looks familiar. Yep, I think I've got it guys, thanks to findagrave.com, luckily there's a nice big um, cross just behind the grave and that, and of course having trees in the background that you can identify always helps, oh that helps, might as well just, <sighs> or maybe not. <sighs> Well, I know it's a section, so it shouldn't be that hard, but do you know what? It's always helpful if you can see the actual headstone, so I'm going to get back onto this pathway. Right. Okay, those trees look. Found them guys, here we go. Right, so, yeah, so it's literally at the like the bottom of this section. Yep. So yeah, we've actually got a few Dickens here in loving memory of Sybil Dickens. Ah, born on the 1st of October, 1889, died the 1st of May, 1934. And her dear husband, Philip Charles Dickens, born the 11th of October, 1887 to the 4th of October, 1964. Yes, now this is Charles Dickens' son in tender and loving memory of Henry Fieldling Dickens, QC, um, common sergeant to the City of London, born the 16th of January 1849 and died the, first, the 21st of December 1933, the sixth son and last surviving child of Charles Dickens. The old-fashioned death, oh thank God, all we see, it's for that, the older fashion, yet of immortal. And, and his beloved and loving wife, Marie Dickens, 6th of December, 1851, to the 3rd of January, 1940. So yeah, this is, so remember guys, this is section L in Putney Vale.
yeah guys sorry that took a little bit longer to find but from me Sharona and the Dickens thank you very much bye bye